Hello, here's a little garden, garage garden update. Germination station, um, April 23rd, 2023. Things are growing marvelously. I let them get pretty dry the other day on accident and they're soaking up more water now that they're uh, getting larger. But these tomato plants varieties are, they're definitely ready for outside uh, to be hardened off and planted. Uh, just need to wait for the weather to cooperate. Lots of varieties of super hots and hots, peppers, and then shishitos that are actually growing peppers in the garage. I was going to top them, um, but uh, time got away from me. Lots of varieties of peppers in here. These are the Buena Malata, these little purple guys here. They're supposed to be like uh, cayenne. And uh, the hydro apple tree back here somewhere. And then, yeah, some my attempt at Kratky Hydro. Things are kind of struggling. I let them get dry on accident. <clears throat> and then uh, lots and lots of uh, Japanese Marisaki sweet potato um, starts going. And then this is cat grass. My cat's been enjoying it. One's inside right now. She's chewing on it. Here's some cactus still rolling from a variety seed pack. Some random cayenne pepper down here. And this is a really nice tub of just random lettuce. I just a little cut and go experiment in this little uh, tray. And so we'll probably start cutting and eating this pretty soon. And then these are the original sweet potatoes back here that I planted on their side. That's the method I recommend. Plant them on their side and keep the soil relatively moist. Uh, some random herbs here, like some thyme, marjoram, summer savory. I had to top those because they were getting so big already. And then uh, some uh, dahlias from a, <clears throat> from a seed pack. So they're like a variety. I don't know. They should be unique because they came from cross-pollination. So um, they all look a little different. So we'll see what happens when I plant those in the ground outside. Yeah. These two down here, these are shop lights from Costco. LED, I think they're 40 watt a piece. And they work great for vegetative growth. But I've just been really impressed with this Mars Hydro light. Uh, the, amount of, the amount of power it has to grow all these plants. And penetrate the canopy and keep everything beneath green too. I don't even have it on 100%, just under 75%. Yeah, looking forward to planting outside. Have a good day.